Hey guys, Rush here, the video on the newly reworked Black Cleaver that was released in patch 5.8. In this video, I'm going to give you my general thoughts, who I think it's good on, how it influences the jungle meta, and give it a little bit of a breakdown. First things first, let's take a look at the item itself. Firstly, its item path is great for junglers because you can build it out of lots of small pieces and work your way up to it. The reason why this is quite appealing for junglers is because they have access to a limited income, often not being able to save up for those huge items and shelling out massive amounts of cash at one time. The stats themselves are great for bruisers and it sets them up pretty nicely for the mid game with a good chunk of HP and damage. The armor shred also sets them up quite nicely for the late game as well. The 20% CDR is really good as well, with the 10% from runes and masteries, and if you choose to go worry enchantment, then when you buy that black cleaver, you'll be at the CDR cap pretty early on. In my personal opinion, I think this 20% CDR is a little bit overtuned, and if it was only 10%, then it wouldn't even be that bad. However, despite the example I gave of buying a warrior enchantment, I actually think that Cinder Hulk into Black Cleaver is a really, really powerful item path. Not only do you get a very decent chunk of health and attack damage, but you also benefit from this Cinder Hulk passive, which increases the amount of health you gain from your items, such as the Black Cleaver. The item path is very good for the tankier bruisers and those bruisers who want to be in teamfights a lot, such as Jarvan, Wukong, and Rek'Sai. The Rage passive on Black Cleaver is very strong as well, as it boosts your move speed on physical damage dealt, not on hit, like the Phage and Triforce does. This is a massive boost to champions with spammable physical damage like Pantheon Q, or sustained physical damage like with Wukong's ultimate. Move speed is extremely beneficial to bruisers as it enables them to chase down opponents and stick onto them. And then there is the armor shred, which is where I want to shift into talking about Black Cleaver relative to the current meta. Shredding armor allows your team to deal more physical damage than in the current tank meta, where you see a lot of overwhelming beefy targets, making it easier to kill them is very, very useful. In addition, physical damage is in general better at cleaving tanks down because it is more sustained damage. Most magic damage is delivered in bursts, with the exception of champions like Cassiopeia and Ryze, who are incidentally very good versus tanks, and that burst damage is stuff which tanks can survive. Now in actuality, in this kind of meta, physical damage dealers are in a bit of a pickle, because these tanks will often dedicate 3, maybe even 4 items just to shutting them down, as opposed to having maybe only 1 magic resist item. But again, this fact leans itself to maximising the value you get out of your Black Cleaver's armor shred, because that armor shred is a percentage, meaning the more armor the enemy has, the more armor you are shredding. With this in mind and knowing that shredding armor is good in the current meta, does this mean that you shouldn't get Cleaver if you're a champion that applies stacks poorly? Well, in my opinion, no. The rest of the stats and the great rage passive more than make up for that. While on the topic of tanks and the current meta, they're definitely very strong, but they also definitely have their weaknesses, namely the early game. Remember in the past, these tank junglers used to get destroyed by the jungle in the early game, and it wasn't just Cinderhawk that brought the tanks to life. If you remember in the same patch, Riot also reduced the damage that the jungle did in the early levels. These bruisers of old outshine the tanks in their early game department, but they fall off in usefulness coming into the mid and late game, which is why they're not picked over them. However, with a very threatening mid game item option with this cleaver, bruisers can do work in the early game and not fall off as hard as the game goes on. However, I do want to emphasize that this tank meta is certainly not dead, and these tanky characters will still be picked in solo queue. In fact, these bruisers, if you go Cinderhawk into Black Cleaver, kind of fill that same role, just a little bit different. So, at the end of the day, who does this Black Cleaver work the best on? Remember, these are just junglers. In my opinion, the best ones are Wukong, Pantheon, and Rek'Sai. However, it is still very good on people like Olaf, Zinzao, Tiger Udi, Riven, Rengar, Vi, Jarvan and Kha'Zix. I have done a video on who I think the best champions this patch are with this Black Cleaver item with a bit of explanations behind that. If you want to go watch that video, I'll put a link to it in the description. Aside from that, that's all I've got to say on the topic, so thanks a lot for watching. If you liked it, feel free to give it a thumbs up. You can subscribe to me for more educational content with a bit of entertaining stuff on the side as well. You can find me on Facebook, on Twitter, and you can catch me streaming on Twitch. All of those links are in the description, guys, but most importantly, thanks so much for watching. Have a great day, and I will see you in my next video.